Do you want to hear the uh, the Lacey Peterson song? Oh, yes. Whew. Whew. Another tragedy. All right, so what's up with the Lacey Peterson song? You got a yawn in front of everyone? Well, I'm stretching. Are we keeping you awake? Yeah. So what, what's the deal? I'm serious. Is this a real Lacey Peterson song? or Yeah, what? no no parody. I just want to see what kind of drivel. Who yeah. is this person? His name is uh, Tony Handy. He's 50, which means he's a failed songwriter, right. a failed performer. Everyone has been moved by the events as they unfold, said Tony Handy. As the story went on, I wanted to get more involved. Great. Of course you did. He wants to capitalize. This is like the uh, the guys, the bands... Right after 9-11. Oh, my God. More, almost as tragic as the event itself were the songs that came out after 9-11. Every band and every bad singer decided that they were going to pull the country together in song after 9-11. And really uh, put forth a song that could capture the emotions and what we were feeling. Ugh. All of them sucked. We actually played a bunch of them on the air and tried to figure out what cornball lines they were going to try to rhyme with uh, with uh, another. You just hit the nail on the head because um, there was two guys that actually wrote songs. Mm. And it also says, both men previously wrote musical tributes about other tragic events. Strand, a guard at dual vocational institution at Tracy, composed Song for America, a patriotic folk song, yeah. four days after September 11th. Four days. Oh. They just want to be involved, and they want people to look for them as as passionate artists. Yeah, and you're all over forty, and you failed, failed performers miserably. Failed those songs. They were rhyming like I don't know, shame and plain tower and power tower. But we have the power. power. Oh, and we were just sickened. Yeah, Ugh. <laughs> these guys just trying to get some kind of recognition with a, a song about a tragedy. So this guy decides he's going to pen a, a Lacey Peterson song. I bet it's just sappy. Oh, yeah. And drippy. Well, let's take a listen. Skip a little. Listen. I just want to see what he uses to word with the rhyme mouthy. <laughs> she was lippy, and as a result, her and Connor got drippy. Uh, ah, starts off nice. nice. Shit did. <laughs> no? The lounge version. Remembering Lacey, Ooh. how her smile would make you smile. Remembering wait, Lacey, wait, wait, wait. how she our smile. What? Our smile would make you smile. Her smile wouldn't make her anyone smile, smile. Would make you smile. Is that what he rhymed? Apparently, her. S oh, I didn't catch the same word. You're right. I think it is. Well, we're gonna have to One play that Jim's part rules. again. I think. Here and then is. we can see what he rhymes it with. I think I heard denial. <laughs> Remembering Lacey, how her smile would make you smile. Oh. Remembering Lacey, how she loved, there's no denial. Oh. Now the angels hold her gently, oh. and little Connor's with her too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh my God! And Lil Con he put Lil Connor in. The only thing, the only reason he should be saying denial is if that's the river she's at the bottom of. Oh God, no! <laughs> ding, ding, ding! It does suck. No Let's hear the rest denial. of it. Remembering Lacey and the way that fat stomach would annoy you when you're going to fuck Amber. <laughs> oh, oh Jesus, guys! He put Lil Connor in. I know. And she smiles and says, we're all right, and we send our love to you. Yeah. Get your lighters out, everyone. What rhymes with Connor besides he's a so little goner? life and happiness was pretty Lacey's life. Uh, with right. little Connor on the way, just made things seem so right. <laughs> Still the two oh. of them together, from the start to heaven's door. <sighs> She smiles and says, we love would rather fuck a to whore. the one she's loved before. Yeah. <laughs> the tears that fell make flowers bloom on earth in heaven too. And little Connor 
runs and picks them. Mama, Even though he's blue. He's for you. <laughs> <laughs> Put on a little Connor Special voice. Yeah. Can we get a little Connor voice again? Yeah, right. Mom, these are for these you. These are for you. Oh, thank you, fetus. What is that cord coming out of your stomach? A little bouquet of seaweed he gives her. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are insane. <laughs> I am convinced you guys are insane with this. <laughs> this is drivel. Oh, mom. Well, may flowers bloom on earth in heaven too. Ugh. And little Connor runs and picks them. Mama, this for you. Ah, mama. Now the angels Why does he talk like Raj from What's Happening? Little wigger. <laughs> Yo, moms, this is for you. As you gaze into the heavens, look, the Lacey Connor star. Ah, ah, ah. Ugh. How about the Lacey Connor bully? <laughs> shut up! Remembering shut up, shut Lacey, up, how her smile up, would make you up, smile. Shut up! Shut up! You shut up! Remembering shut Lacey, up. how she loved, there's no denial. Now the angels hold her gently, <laughs> and little Connor's with her too. Turn it off! And she smiles and says, we're all right. <laughs> Send our love to you. <laughs> and we send our love to you. That is awful. Wow, that is horrific. Hey, can we can we get one of these guys on the phone for Monday? Is that possible? Oh, can we play yeah. the song? Let's. I think we should interview one of these guys. Yeah, we want to see what. Um... Can we do that? He's all about. That's the only one. Oh, 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 oh God! That isn't on the song. Great ending. Oh, that's perfect. Oh, that is hilarious. Oh, the little bouquet of seed. Oh. One body enter, two bodies leave. Oh, is that horrible? Oh, yuck. Uh, Mama, these are for you. Oh. That is everything that's wrong with music. Rod Stewart shit dick. <laughs> <laughs> and, and AIDS and Scott will kill you. That was oh, awful. Thanks. Wow. Let's go down to Orlando. Oh. Dave, what's up? Oh, what's going on, man? Hey. Oh, God. Hey, I've man. been listening to you guys for the past two days on the free view, and... Uh, I haven't been able to sleep. Oh, good. I yeah. swear, if if somebody is waiting until this very last minute to sign up, what a bunch of schmucks. I agree. The show will go away unless you uh, add it to your XM radio account. Absolutely. It's two bucks. Two, two bucks. lousy dollars. That? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Thanks, uh, buddy. Well, thank you, buddy. Yeah, no problem. I wish you guys the best of luck. Look forward to hearing you on Monday. Uh, Monday gets a lot. That's right. Seedier. Mama. 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 These are for you. A bouquet of seaweed. <laughs> 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 we got to go out to Phoenix. What's oh, up, Rob? Hey, guys. How you doing? Pretty good, man. I'm a former Marine. I'm a truck driver. And I've heard a lot of rough shit, but I've never heard anything as offensive and gross as you all. I oh, really? Is that a compliment? Well, and that's why I'm signing up. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Oh, I was scared there. Yes. Uh, thank you, thank sir. you, sir. Listen, can I get the address of the Little Connor Loves Company Fund so I can send in all the money I save? <laughs> wow. All that money he's saving for yeah, the rest of the yeah, year free. It's dollars. Lots and lots of free. dollars. Oh, thanks, Rob. Thanks, we buddy. appreciate it. Thanks, guys. All right. See ya. Getting requests uh, for this little <laughs> thing here. Hey, mama. Hey, mama. Hey, mama. Here's the football gay preview. Rerun and Dwayne are coming over. <laughs> Today he was a little Puerto Rican. He would have said, hey, mommy. <laughs> hey, mommy. This for you. Yuck.
Football what game preview. <laughs> we'll take more requests and we'll play What Do We Learn? We're not going to break. We're just playing this we, um, and, and coming back. I didn't uh, go for it at all. It's coming to the Gay Channel. What is it? It's the second annual male group orgy competition. And he hits the hole right after Jesse opens it up. With your host, John Madden and Pat Summerall. And then everyone's kind of slopping around down there and grunting and groaning. And, you know, you get mud and stuff flying and gang tackles and scrums and quagmires. No femmes, fats, or harrys, just the hunkiest gay studs in wild group action competition. I'd like to pack that guy around, too. Don't get carried away, John. There was all kinds of stuff flying around there. It's male group sex to die for, as described by the best play-by-play -play team in the biz. Yeah, that was a late one. That one didn't come and didn't come and didn't come, and finally they threw it out of there. Whoop. I don't know where that one came from. Look at that big old meat oh, lump. Oh, what a meal those guys are having. look good. That's a good group. If you go nuts for tight butts, you push, you push, you push. Get gay for you today. And just Show. load him backward. Just put him right on his back. With Pat Summerall and John Madden. That looked like it, it was the last shot out of the Roman candle. I mean, the second annual male group orgy competition on gay per view. I'd like to pack that guy around, too. Boy, yeah. He's going to fire into his guy right here. Call 1-800-HEY-CUTIE to order today. <laughs> <laughs> they don't show you 10 years later, um, you know, when uh, Connor is torturing animals or being arrested for things. They will not. Connor's stop. a bad boy. They will not stop talking about it. How can we not? <laughs> you guys are unbelievable. A little dead kid handing flowers over. It's creepy. Salt water unwraps the duct tape <laughs> from the bag around her head. Oh, my God. Jerry Lee Lewis from Whackbag, Anthony from Charlotte. Just like Opie's family cars, two left the house, but only one return. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, Very nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They want to know if Linda McCartney's singing that song, Anthony? Mm. Look, see, now people like Mike... I'm saying uh, they, he's got an idea for the song. He liked the splash, but he goes, "Please play the sound of the motorboat speeding away." <laughs> oh, God help us, Chuck in Ohio. What did you learn on the show today? Today I learned that with Falun Gong, you get happy ending for your dong. Oh, there you go. Very yeah, good. I forgot about All that. All right, let's go to Rob in uh, or on or from. I think it's Long Island, so it should be Rob on Long Island. Yes, Rob. Hey, guys. Hey. How's uh, my sweet tits doing? Over Hi, there? fella. I'm okay. Thanks for asking. How are you? No problem. I'm doing good. I learned that Jimmy Norton has sensitive baby ass skin all over his fat, pudgy body. You're right. Mm. Yeah, unfortunately, we did learn that. Jim on Long Island. What's up, Jim? Hey, what up? Oh, hey, I just want to know uh, if you ever took uh, Chester fishing. Uh, let's move on to Darren. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Who's in Orlando? What's up, Darren? Oh, wait, wait. Boys, what's going hey, Opie, on? this is for you. <laughs> what? I learned that the free play cliffhanger is Opie kicking the family pet in the liver. Nice job, Dick. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do a, no such little thing. Gi little Jimmy. Little Jimmy. Hey, Helen, these are for you. <laughs> Handing over a cape. <laughs> a fistful of cape. Todd from whackbag.com. Yes, uh, Todd. Good morning, boys. Good morning. Hello. Hello. Morning, sweet cheeks. Hi, Angel Eyes. <laughs> hey, I learned today that if the buffet includes crabs, Jimmy's going back for seconds. Ooh, You're absolutely right. right. He did go back for second. <laughs> hey, also, if you guys get a chance, uh, take a look at the unofficial Tony Danza website. The Army did a job on the on its guest board last night. Oh, we'll have to take a look. Again look. they did it? They hit it again? I think the uh, unofficial one. Uh, on the unofficial one. Yeah, the guest book has all kinds of uh, Peterson family references. <laughs> oh, my God. Sonny got mad. We hit the Danza board at 2 o'clock this <laughs> <laughs> 4 o'clock this morning. <laughs> Funky Treasure uh, checking uh, in. He hmm. writes, I learned that prime rib can cause liver problems in dogs today. Oh. I don't oh, know what he's talking boy. about there, Anthony. Connor Peterson checking in. Today I learned that Brian Regan's peanut butter bit two years ago is what you got what got you guys fired. Oh, uh, did Lacey say a Hail Mary before the splash? What? Every time I said a Hail Mary, I caught a bouquet of seaweed. <laughs> says Freddie F. from Philly. <laughs> I love the Godfather reference. Oh, they're always funny. Bob Pup seaweed. Bob Papa writes, uh, Reagan's son's microphone is part of the Voss stand up comedy kit. Ah. Regan. Oh, not Reagan. Reagan. Oh, Regan. Yeah, yes, I, I was a stand-up comic. I'm tired. We're going to go see Brian Regan tonight. It's going to be fun. Spooge Demon, today I learned that dead fetuses know perfectly good English. 
Oh. Andrew Long, I learned that a bouquet of seaweed will get Opie out of the animal murder conversation every time. Uh... Mama, these for you. Uh, just stunk. Oh, lacy star. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Drivel being written. Well, star is a big bloated thing of gas, so... Oh, <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, no. All right. Even Anthony couldn't wow. hang with that, that is one. That's technically true. Jeff in Iowa, what's up? Well, I learned that uh, when Norton was forced to take the gig out of the program, he just brought in the elevator. Yeah. You're right. Yeah, he out of the still does it in the, the elevator. elevator. That's very good. Matt, on oh. Long Island. What's up, Matt? What's up, Matt? Uh, today I learned that Fred the Elephant Boy is the leader of the Majuang. I don't really get that one. Tim, what's up? I don't know what that you is. Know, Falun Gong makes you invisible, and people set themselves on Steve to do it. Very good. Yes. Duke in Jersey, what's up? Yeah, I learned that uh, Lil Connor picks seaweed and algae and sinks to the bottom. Hey, Mama, here's some flowers. <laughs> <laughs> what a mess. This, what a mess your presentation was. <laughs> I like the sound effect at the end, though. <laughs> it really sounded like it was going yeah, down. Boom, boom, boom. Peter from WackBag.com, he learned that Noah stores Rent Boys on his phone. Oh. Rev wants to to say, hey, Opie, why don't you donate your pickled punk to the Peterson family as a consolation prize? <laughs> Holy <laughs> S. <laughs> oh, first a thousand pickled punks. Demon Seed from WackBag.com. We should also mention the other <laughs> Opie and Anthony message board, OpieAnthony.net. Right. I learned that Noah is horrible at text messaging sex. Bye-bye. <laughs> See you Monday. sucked to hear the open anthony show five days a week live on satellite radio online on your phone or tablet or even on demand go to SiriusXM.com. also interact with the open anthony show on twitter at op radio at anthony cumia and at jim norton